Hi boys and girls, welcome back for another little lesson. Today we're going to learn the story about David and Goliath. It is a true story from the Bible, how God took care of David and was with him when he came against a great big giant that everyone else was afraid of. We're going to use some of the toys from the nursery to tell the story today. And here is David. Hello, I'm David. And he was a shepherd boy who took good care of his sheep. Bah! Bah! David loved God with all of his heart. I love God. He is so wonderful. Well, God took good care of David too. One day, David's dad came to see him and he said, David, I would like you to go and take some food to your brothers who are in the Israelite army. Okay, I will go and do that, father. So, the sheep didn't go and David's father didn't go, but David went, he took the food the food and he went to see the Israelite army where his brothers were. And here we have the pretend Israelite army. I've put beards on all of them because they are men already, but David, he is still a boy. When he got there, the army was quite upset. There is a giant named Goliath who wants to fight us. We are all afraid. He is so, so big. Yeah, I want to go home to my mom. This is scary. Well, David couldn't believe it. But you are the Israelite army, the army of the living God. How could that giant Goliath come against God's army? I will fight the giant. Well, when the king heard that David would fight the giant, he tried to give him his armor. You're just a boy. I don't know if you can fight a giant. God help me. He helped me stop a bear and a lion when they came after my sheep. And he will help me stop this giant who comes against his army. Okay, well, if you stop Goliath, then I will give you lots of riches and you can marry the princess. So David, he set out to fight Goliath. And here comes Goliath. I'm Goliath and I'm very, very big. I'm going to fight the Israelite army and then they have to serve me. So David, he got his sling and five stones. I come against you in the name of the living God. And Goliath, ha, 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 He just saw that David was a boy. He didn't realize that God was with him. David took his sling, whoosh, 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 and flung a stone. And it hit Goliath right in the middle of the forehead. And Goliath was stopped. And all the army cheered, yay! And David, he praised God because he knew that God gave the victory. Lucia? Lucia, is, is that you, Lucia? Yeah! Why are you hiding beneath your blanket? Because I'm really scared. Well, why are you scared? Because of that giant in the story named Goliath. He was scary. Oh, Lucia, you don't need to be afraid. I don't? No. God was with David, and God protected David when David came up against that giant. He, he certainly was. He was a lot smaller, but God was with him 
and God helped David stop that giant who was coming against God's army. So, so I don't need to be afraid, do I? No, you don't. God is always with us. Oh, I feel a lot better now. Oh, I'm glad, Lucia. Thanks for joining me for another little lesson. And as I go, I thought I would just show you what those little frogs have been up to in the nursery. They were helping out on the set today. Pause now and see if you can find all 10 little frogs. Hey, Kristen, did you hear what's arrived? What's that? It's our press play virtual camp and I am so excited. Are you serious? Send that over. Okay, here it comes. I can't wait to see what's inside. I wonder what this does. 